All right, well, here's another way to run this little window motor that I showed in my last video. Uh, I used a commutator type of affair here to run it last time on a 12 volt battery. Then I started playing around with other circuits uh, besides the Bedini circuits that might work on this. And uh, SMART Creations uh, and DadHav have a complementary transistor circuit that I used on my paperclip motor. And it runs just fine using just one of the coils. This is by filer coil. Uh, it's not wound like a Newman motor. These uh, wires are all wound together uh, in one big bundle. It, it splits around the shaft, but it's really all one big bundle. But there are four wires that come off of it, two separate coils. And I tried to run this in series on that little uh, circuit. Uh, mart, but it, it wouldn't run, so I had to split it up, and I was running it on the one coil, it ran just great. And I thought, well, why, why don't I do something with the second coil, the generator coil, so I put a Jewel Thief circuit on it. And uh, for some reason, the way the induction goes on this, watch what happens. Not only does the Jewel circuit, uh, Jewel Thief circuit go off, but the motor circuit goes off, when I just hand spin this. Now you can make it run just great if you just put a capacitor on it here and uh, I'll show you what happens. And there it goes. Now it runs in either direction too. You can run it uh, this way, or I can stop it and run it the other way. And like I say, that's a dual thief circuit on one of the windings, and then the complementary transistor circuit on the other winding. And this looks like it's really, really cool running on a capacitor, but that's not a normal capacitor. That's a 5 farad super capacitor with uh, about 2.5 volts in it. And uh, it only runs for a short period of time. It's drawn about 50 milliamps. But it made a really cool looking uh, device. No battery, just a capacitor. And then, of course, like I say, if you take the capacitor out of it, no capacitor, it will run on inertia energy. And so this might be a really good uh, setup for like a wind generator or any kind of a thing that you could turn that with. And it kind of runs on its own. So anyway, just one more way to run this little uh, window motor that I came up with. Thanks for watching.